I spoke with Brecken. He's depressed and wants to go talk to Rice himself. Except that'll only get him killed. Maybe I can help out. Jade knows where we might be able to get more antis in. I'm supposed to meet her in one of the boxcars near the school. Holy shit! What's on your mind? Mr. Crane, are you familiar with a man named Vulcan Yasif Dahl? Vulcan Dahl? Yeah, of course. He owns Vulcan Petrol Engineering. He's the richest man in Haran. That's exactly right. And Mr. Dahl has need of your service. I didn't know he was still in the city. Most of his employees were evacuated, but his two chief engineers are still here in the slums. They're brothers. Twins, in fact. Tolga and Fatin. They've been working on a special project. It's highly confidential, and I'm afraid I can't discuss it. But I can assure you its importance is nearly beyond measure. Well, then I won't bother trying to measure it. The brothers are brilliant engineers, but they're also somewhat, uh, idiosyncratic. This, and the problems of operating in the current environment, have put them behind schedule. Mr. Darb would like you to assist them to get the project back on track. You will be well compensated, as you can imagine. Doing what? Simply do as they ask. You'll only be needed from time to time, and the task will be of short duration. Removing obstacles, you might say. They'll contact you when your assistance is required. I'll think about it. Thing. Yeah, who is this? This is Tolga. And Fatin? We work for Mr. Dahl, and we are ready to put you to task. Get here on the double. Make it quick. Hey, that's rude. Tolga, don't, don't talk to me like that. Shut up, Fatin. Get off the radio. You're going to make him mad, you idiot. Stop talking or I will punch you. Punch me? I'll kill you! We are waiting for you. Yes, hurry up! You're putting us behind schedule. boxes out of that place for hours. We need to get a closer look. What's in the boxes? Great question. If it's answers in, we need it. Thank you. 
another dead end. Okay. Shit. You'll have to come in the way I did. I just hope we can find another way out if we have to. Head for the outbuilding on the roof. Saw Tahir at the school. He and his men were hauling all kinds of stuff out of there. What the hell are they up to? Anyway, the fucker executed some survivors right in front of us. Nearly saw us. Time to sneak into that building. I hope there's some antizen in there somewhere. Okay, Jade, I'm inside. Check the classrooms. That's the most likely place for them to store supplies. They should be marked somehow. Military jargon is pretty straightforward, so it shouldn't be hard to notice. Get through that way. Maria, we don't have all day for this shit, and this is the last place I want to be at night. Did any of you idiots think to check the basement? Of course not, because the key is still up here. Get your shit together!
Jade, no luck with any antizin. Looks like we'll have to talk about that other option. I still have classroom C to search, though. The basement's pretty big. Find the key. I'll meet you down there. Here, would you? Yeah, sure. God, Crane, you're such an old. Why don't you just stick your head out the door and shout, Here we are, come get us! Hey, sometimes there's nothing wrong with a direct approach. Holy shit. That's plastic explosives, right? I 
listen, you take this stuff and get back to the tower. I'll deal with these assholes. Don't be ridiculous. We'll fight them together. And risk letting them keep this much ordinance? No, just go. I got this. Meet me back at the tower. Promise me you won't let Rahim near that hut. What? Yeah, of course. I promise. I promise. Just go. Shit. Jade and I went looking for Antizen and found explosives instead. Now we need to get the hell out of here before Tahir comes back. But right now, let's deal with these explosives, okay? Okay, listen. I'll give the explosives to Saeed and you talk to Rahim. Make sure he stays away from that hive. We'll do. Don't worry. Don't worry? Right. Jade called me. She's taking the explosives to Saeed. She wanted me to talk to Rahim about the volatile hive and how she wants him to stay the hell away from it. Kren, Saeed told me about the explosives you guys found. How perfect is that? Jade gave them to him. Saeed used to be on a bomb squad, so he knows about that stuff. Yeah, kid. That was a lucky find. Would've been better to turn up some antis in, though. My buddy Omar is making sure Saeed's putting good timers on those things. We have to be able to get our asses out of there before they blow. Whoa, we? There, there's no we in this. I, I mean, yeah, that nest needs to go, and now it's possible, but, but if it gets done, I'm doing it on my own. But... It's my plan. And I will execute it perfectly, I promise. But... Ah, oh, shit. 
There's no use arguing with you, is there? Fine. I'll contact you as soon as Saeed's finished with the charges. Raheem, do we have a deal? I guess. Do we have a deal? Yes. We have a deal. Okay, one more thing. I keep seeing this bizarre kind of infected. Is Dr. Zera out at his trailer? I'd like to talk to him about it. Nah, he's down in sickbay visiting Dr. Lina. Thanks, kid. I'll see you soon. Hey, Doc, you got a minute? Oh, it's, uh, Kane. Yes. Uh, how can I help you? A crane. Remember when I told you about that weird infect that I saw? You know, the one who took one look at me and hauled ass away? Yeah, well, I just saw another one, and it did the same thing. Hmm. I believe I have heard your colleagues talk about those creatures. Bolters, they call them. Apparently, they favor certain areas of town over others, but only appear at night. I don't suppose you could catch one and bring me a sample of its flesh. You see, a thought occurred to me. A long shot, I realize. But if these creatures favor areas where I left my experimental bait, well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Please do obtain a sample, but it has to be fresh. So you have to get it back to me quickly. Okay, and where exactly do I find these things? I'm told that Quartermaster chap has been keeping track of them. Zera asked me to bring him a sample from that bolter I saw in front of the school. He said they'd been spotted in specific areas of the city, so I should focus my search in those places. He also said I needed to get that sample back to him while it was still fresh. So I gotta move. to be done around the tower. I hope you find some time to take a look at it. What can I do for you? Doc Zera says you know where I should look for these, uh, bolters. Super fast infected, covered in big green blisters. Oh yeah, yeah. I can point you in the right direction. Here, here, and here. Though you ask me, if trouble don't come looking for you, no reason to go looking for trouble. <laughs> Words to live by, thanks. <laughs> 